Marriage is hard. My character's marriage is going through ups and downs and hills and valleys, and she'll do anything she can to fix it. Adam Scott is so wonderful. Isn't I mean, he? I just oh had such a great experience with him this season. What an incredible actor who's so facile and can break your heart, but also make you laugh. He's tender in other moments, and his deep love of Madeline is so palpable. Mm, yeah. He just loves this mm, woman, and yeah, he's yeah. so conflicted because she's done some things to hurt him. She's and women prickly. do she's things to prickly. hurt people. Yeah. What did you say? Prickly. She's, she's prickly. She's <laughs> prickly. Yeah, yeah, she can be prickly, but she's also human and flawed and fighting her way to get back to something that really matters to her, but has to have it and be in jeopardy before she realizes how important Marriage it is. Marriage is complicated, right? <laughs> well, you could call it compromat, you know, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, secrets are problematic for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> they're messy and they're hard to keep track mm -hmm. of. They're tiring. They take. You're, they're draining. I do think honesty starts with being honest with yourself. I think, you know, a lie can be like a cancer, like a sickness, right? I mean, I, I actually think that that's how people I get, get sick. sick. If I lie, for sure. Yeah, but it's also perspective. So, the perspective of what you consider the lie. I mean, I think, and where you're at in your own state of being, what you even allow in as a lie or as a truth or what you're compartmentalizing or your own ability to even. So I find that question hard to answer. People go into analysis for into, years to yeah, find out so, what they're, I mean, to be the honest with themselves. I mean, the truth of who you are to yourself. Yes. It's like you're asking to unravel terrible mm -hmm. complexities at times, particularly, say, in so, relation to my own character, the idea of what am I keeping secrets or whether I even consider them secrets or whether I consider them protection or whether I consider them just my nature mm. of existing and survival, mm. which is mm. built up from a basis that once you unravel that, you sort of unravel all of it. So it's just, you know, survival for each one of these women and the way they've formed is what's really interesting. Yeah, and then you layer motherhood then, over that and like caring for children on top of what do you say, what do you say to the kids, what do you tell your friends, and what do you tell your husband, versus you don't what do you to tell share? Chloe anything, because she knows <laughs> everything. everything. Yeah, and, it, and when's the, right <laughs> the right time? Everything. Yeah, when's the right time? And you two have a really interesting yeah. dynamic in the show where you are co-parenting three little boys. And have disagreements on what we consider they should know and not know, I which is good. I think that's fascinating. It's one of my really? favorite scenes mm -hmm. is when you say, well, I have to tell mm -hmm. my son certain thing, and you're like, I don't, is that I'm going to reshoot that scene. I feel like now I know how to play it. I would love to read you that. <laughs> my mom growing up would always say, truth without compassion is cruelty. And that's sort of been my guiding light. And even that statement in itself is, because you're like, well, what, what is compassion? And am I lying to someone if I know it's going to hurt them? Should I not hurt them? And, but I think if you really, for me, that's kind of my meter and barometer, even with myself. Like, if I'm going to force myself to face a truth, but I'm not being compassionate, towards myself in that truth, then it's cruel. It's cruel, and it causes so much pain that sometimes I wonder if, if that pain is actually propelling us into further consciousness or if it's propelling us into a deeper, darker kind of hole of self-deprecation or projection or insecurity, and it's really interesting.